So happy Monday everyone. I am just hopping on really quickly to talk about some common misconceptions surrounding um, brand strategy. If you're not familiar with who I am, my name is Sydney Hart. I am a brand strategist. I'm also a designer as well as a copywriter. Um, and I specifically help rebrand content um, creation and content strategy experts so they can stop relying on social to sell their services um, and truly, truly establish their brand voice, build credibility in their marketplace, um, and ultimately compete. Let's talk about a lot of the misconceptions. So I only have about three here. Um, I'm only gonna spend about the next few minutes um, chatting about them. But of course, if you guys have questions, drop them down below. And then if you have questions, if you're watching the replay, just shoot me a DM or pop them in the comments, right? So the first misconception about brand strategy a lot of the times is most people think that it's simple, right? Um, and as a brand strategist, as a designer, my job is to make it as simple as possible for the client, but it's not that I just ask a couple of questions and we hit the ground running, right? Brand strategy isn't something that can necessarily be done, um, at least with my process in a 30 minute meeting and I have all that I need, right? So you really have to, um, think about a lot of the questions that you might not even think is important, right? So sometimes I'll ask clients um, just a simple question of, tell me your story as to how you got here. Like from the moment you, you started this work until now, how did that look, right? And to them, it might seem like, well, I started in high school or, oh, um, I got my first camera in college and, um, you know, it just turned into something that I love. But ultimately, uh, what I'm doing is I'm pulling out um, what makes you the greatest, right? What makes you the best choice um, to your client? So that way I can position you um, in the best light. The misconception that it's simple um, is like completely false, right? It is a complex process that you may not see a lot of, but it's still happening, right? So the next misconception um, that I usually run into is that you can hop right into it, right? Um, and I think there, there, there is a sense of, you know, let's just do it. Um, you're welcome, Nicole. There is a sense of let's just do it, which I'm all the way down for. Um, but I think with brand strategy, a lot of business owners really have to ask themselves a couple questions before they even start, right? So they have to say, why am I doing this in the first place? Is it to get more clear on who I serve? Is it to establish uh, myself as a, a personal brand, as a CEO, as the face of the company? Is it to um, become more of an authority figure, more of a force in my industry? Because I think when you do things like run a business, that's different than showing up and speaking on panels or speaking in um, summits or online conferences, right? You have to make sure that all those things are like clear as day. Um, the other question I think you should ask yourself before you start brand strategy, before you hop right into it, is who should I work with, right? So even if you are like, look, brand strategy, all that jazz is not for me, like let me go ahead and hire someone, you wanna make sure that you're asking yourself the right questions um, in order to get the right person that's gonna ask um, what needs to be asked to get you where you want to be, right? There are brand strategists who go super duper duper in depth. There are brand strategists who give you a five page deck and call it a day. Um, but you have to get super duper clear on why you're doing it because you can't just hop into it. Um, you have to have a plan and research attached to it, right? So research your ideal client, research their psychographics, not only their demographics, right? Research um, why they're making decisions. Research how they're making decisions. You have to research um, your story at the end of the day because that bio that you wrote out five years ago might not fit you, right? So brand strategy can fit a whole lot of different pockets in your business, but it's not simply something that you can hop into. Strategy is something that is a collaborative process most of the time. Um, and even if you're doing brand strategy on your own, I would definitely seek out um, a book or a YouTube channel um, or an Instagram page such as mine um, that will help you kind of build those blocks up, even if you kind of want to DIY over the next few weeks, few months by yourself, right? So the last misconception um, that's attached to brand strategy is that it's there just for show, right? 
So there's a lot of um, people who get brand strategy done and never look at the deck again, right? And never go back to um, what they worked on with the brand strategies. Or I've even talked to designers who said, I, I do all that brand strategy work and I can tell my client does not go back and look at it, right? They don't um, stay true to the voice, the tone, um, the how they want to show up in the world, right? So everything comes from their strategy there's nothing that's there for show everything is there for a reason right and if you don't know that reason if you're still kind of cloudy about that reason simply ask your brand strategist ask your designer ask um any professional that's around in order to get more clarity um, because you don't want to necessarily get all of that research and all that planning done for nothing um so you either want to do the internal work um when it comes to brand strategy brand strategy is either there for internal or external honestly in my opinion it should be both um but you want to ask yourself what is important to your ideal client and then what pushes this business forward because those two questions are super important right and that's what brand strategy is kind of based upon the fact that um you get a document or you get a strategy session and you gain tons of clarity in the first 30 minutes should be a sign that this is work that you should have done a long time ago right and this is work that you can't ignore in the future so i suggest um if especially like i always suggest even if you're having trouble um coming up with social media captions look at your brand strategy deck i suggest um going back to your brand strategy desk every or your brand strategy deck or document or whatever it is that you have laid out every three months right or every month when you're planning content when you're writing emails even when you're um planning to work with the client and you're kind of not sure because it will give you so much clarity to revisit that work um that your brand strategist works so hard on first of all but that ultimately um can help you um thrive in your business right so let's just do a quick recap i told you guys i'm not gonna be in your face for too long when it comes to working through your brand strategy whether diy or with a brand strategist there are usually three misconceptions that i come across um usually it's that it can be very simple even though it's a very complex process um another misconception usually is that you can hop right into it without a plan without any research attached to it um when usually strategy is something that's based specifically on research um and it's a collaborative process and then third um usually the third misconception is it's there for show um it's there to just sit in your drawer after you get your brand strategy deck to never be looked at again um i even suggest a lot of the times like if there are any pages in your deck that kind of hit you in the heart print them out and take them up on your wall so you never you know have to keep going back to that drawer save it on your phone like save it in a google drive or save it um in uh what is it kind of the pdf readers in um apple right so if you are in need of a rebrand if your brand strategy is old crusty and ashy it's time to reach out so my, that link is in my bio to fill out a form and learn more about my signature package um, my signature rebrand package um and i'm gonna wrap up here of course if you guys have any questions for me afterwards shoot me a dm throw them in the comments this replay will be up here in about three to five minutes here um and thank you guys so much for joining me i really appreciate it you guys have a good monday